So right here, fellas, is a perfect example of what the farmers do to stop the spread of salinity. And it's a ugly sight when you look at it. And you just see where the farmer has come here for a big excavator. And you all, just even below the surface, fellas, about, I don't know, a metre, a metre and a half below the surface, you can see the white salt. So a metre and a half below the surface is all salt, fellas. It's absolutely disgusting. And, yeah, it's a real, real shame, fellas. I can't believe it. This is a massive one. This is one of the biggest uh, salt diversion ditches that I've ever seen. So I'm on the other side, or standing on the big embankment, what's just been dug for it, uh, guys, in the last six months or so and here's a perfect example a natural creek bed right here what's been blocked and perfect example how lakes like my uh, hometown lake Lake Dombuyong this here would be a water catchment area it would eventually flow into Lake Dombuyong and now look at it it's all been blocked off it's only a small um, creek bed fellas but you can just see there's no way in the world any water is going to come through here not even with a big flood there's a big chance of if it floods this whole area here is all going to get caught in this big flood plain here so it's an unnatural thing unnatural um, and you just see here fellas natural creek bed right here and look at all the salt on the edge of the natural creek bed and and the whole creek bed has just been totally diverted now by a farmer probably stopping the spread of salinity around this area or for his farming paddocks to grow wheat and barley oats and so forth but like i say guys you see all these beautiful old creek beds a long time ago these would have been flowing during winter periods of rain and now there's no one in the world they can actually flow and it's very rarely do they even flow anymore you can just see all the silt here look at all this silt so this creek here would have been a lot deeper over a hundred years ago and now you can just see because all the farming or this silt has built up here from when it does actually rain and flood there's no way in the world so this is just one example of thousands Tens of thousands of little creek beds, guys, would have just been blocked off due to agricultural purposes.